If you are in any need of prayer or advice, make sure you comment or email. God bless you. I believe that God speaks to us all. But it comes down to if you are willing to listen or not. Some people may think that everyone or in order to hear God's voice, you have to hear his actual voice, as in how you can hear my voice now. God can speak to us through our thoughts, through other people, and through other means. I believe that God speaks to many of us, but many of us aren't willing to listen. Sometimes when some people contact me, I read or listen to what they say. And within what they are saying or writing, I can see that they can hear God's voice, but it comes down to they aren't willing to do it, so they doubt themselves when they know that what came from God and to their thoughts or whatever else, they know that that is the right thing to do. But since they really don't want to do it, they try to find another way, another answer, so that they won't have to do what they know is right. God speaks to us all, but it comes down to if you are willing to listen. For instance, <laughs> my Lord. There is something I believe God wants me to do. But for a while, I was hesitating because it is something that I usually don't do. And it is not a big deal. <laughs> Actually, it is something really small. But I was thinking, it is something I don't do and it is not my style. And this may sound really stupid to you, but it has been coming to me and I have no idea, but God knows why I have to do it. But it has been coming to me to tell my family members that I love them. Which, with some of them, I never told that to. Never told that to. Some of my family members, I never told them that I love them. Never. Now, I do love them. And I believe I show my love through my actions, I guess. But what have been happening to me or coming to me, I guess you can say, Kevin, tell this person that you love them. And I was thinking, I don't do that. <laughs> you know, I was having, I was trying to give so many reasons of why I should not do it. Because for some of us, we don't go to each other and say that we love each other. Now, some of the women in my family may do it, but for the men, no. So when it continued to come to me to tell other people that I love them, I was fighting with it. 
you have no idea. I was fighting against that idea so much. And I was thinking, is this really God? <laughs> is God really telling me to do this? I was making so many excuses trying to get confirmations when I kind of knew that it is something that God wants me to do. But I was trying to push it away or do something else other than doing what I believe God wants me to do. And when I started to do it with other people, telling them I love them, it was so embarrassing. <laughs> you know, to see the big smile on their face and, uh, you know, making those sounds and stuff like that. Maybe that is pride, probably. Maybe that is hidden, hidden pride within me. Maybe God saw that pride within me. This is the reason why he wants me to go and tell other people that I love them. My other family members that I love them. Which... <laughs> It is not as hard now, but before, I was really, really contemplating. <laughs> I don't know if this is really God, when I kind of knew that it is God. So my point is, you can hear God's voice. Chances are, you just don't want to do what God is placing upon you or placing upon your mind. You need to do it. I find that for everything that God wants us to do, there is a special purpose for it. You have no idea how it is going to affect others when you do what God wants you to do. So take the focus off yourself so Kevin take the focus <laughs> off yourself and place it upon what you need to do for God so let me stop here God bless you all make sure you share this and subscribe God bless you